The room shook with emotion this morning as curator Philemore Alkin announced the opening of the Tomorrow Culture Through the Arts exhibit, despite recent losses in the art community. Within the last two day, um, day I've lost two good friends who are involved in the art community. One was a framer for Art and Frame Gallery, and the other one is Jose Babauta. The first person is Ivan Sanchez, the go-to framer for many local artisans, while the second is Alcon's dear friend and well-known artist, Jose Babauta. We had all known that Joe was um, not going to make it. But the thing is, is how long will he be with us? So it was like back and forth. Will he be on the tribute wall? Will he be memorialized for this exhibit? And guess what? He is going to be a part of this show. With his recent passing, Pabalta will be featured in the first exhibit entitled A Night of Remembrance, which takes place January 9th through the 31st. It is dedicated to our Chamorro ancestors, as well as to the legacy of local artisans who have gone before us. Alkin said it's important to remember them because they formed a part of the Chamorro culture. The next event happens on February 6th through February 28th and is entitled A Moon Art Exhibit. This exhibit honors the faces of the moon, which were used by our Chamorro ancestors to guide their way of life. The gallery is located inside the Terlahi building in Aganya and will be open Monday through Friday, 8 to 5 p.m. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Issa Baza.